Hey guys, so finally made it to Austin to uh, SG Expo and, oh, what the, yeah. So the first thing you're greeted by is you're greeted by uh, Itasha cars and the weep stop. So, yeah, so man, this has been the longest drive ever. Like, I've driven to Houston and Houston wasn't this long. Like, it just felt really long. Ugh. Hey guys, hey guys, look who I ran into. A husbando of where the wife is. <laughs> now we walk into the dealer room where um we got all the people signing there. They have these. And let's see what other not safe for work stuff can we find? Okay, we have this not safe for work stuff, that not safe for work stuff. <laughs> It's essentially just like a regular dealer room, except there's just a few not safe for work stuff. Huh. What up, everybody? Digging Rap here at SGX. I'm here with Bryson Vargas. Hey, that's me. Yeah, he's the voice actor of Aldini from Food Wars. So, Aldini. Since voicing Aldini, right? Have you uh, started doing more home cooking, specifically Italian style dishes? Like, uh, did you, so after voicing, did you like, like go home and be like, I'm Aldini, we're gonna make this Italian dish, we're not gonna eat, you know? Have you, did you, did you, did you do that? Uh, nothing quite so dramatic. I have been cooking a bit more over the past year or so at, at home to get better at that stuff and I have cooked some pastas here and there. I even participated in an online uh, food war with another person. Wow! An online food war? Wow! Yeah, I ended up making uh, uh, some fettuccine alfredo with, uh, with spinach and, and goat cheese. Wow! Dude, like, I'm not an alfredo guy. Like, that's the thing. I love Italian food, but I just, I just cannot with alfredo. I, I don't know. It's my favorite. Yeah. I love alfredo. Yeah. Now, is there any behind-the-scenes stories you can tell us? Like, for example, at Spider-Man Homecoming, right? Michael Keaton would yell out, Oh, I'm Batman when they were doing the fight scene. Oh, Is there any behind the scenes story you can tell us? Um, so nothing, some, nothing quite I'm Batman, but I do remember the very first session I had for Food Wars. Uh -huh. uh, I made a huge mistake and I did not eat anything uh, leading up to the session. And I was in that booth for like four hours staring at all these pretty drawings of uh, animated food, which everyone knows anime food looks the best. Uh, so I was pretty hungry uh, by the end of it. So that's, that was pretty fun. Alright, got you. Now for my last question. You're going into a food war at Aldini. And just like the wrestlers of WWE who tell, tell us what they're going to do to their opponent in the ring right before they go out, what were you going to do to your opponent when you get into food war? Alright, I'll probably be like something like, Hey Soma Yukihira, I will defeat you and I'll use my Metsaluna to do something. I'll chop up the cheese, I'll chop up the nuts, the garlic, everything, and I'll even chop you up in the ring. Yeah, and then end with, are you ready? Aldini is ready! Are you ready? Aldini is ready! What up, y'all? Thank you for having me here with Kissy Cosplay. Hi! Alright, so Kissy, uh, you enjoying your time here at SG Expo? Yeah! Gotcha, gotcha. So what's an anime that you're watching right now? Right now I've been watching Modao Zushi. It's a Chinese anime and it's on YouTube. Gotcha. Yeah. Madaji, I've never heard that. Why should I watch Madaji? Why should they watch Madai Yayao? Modao Zushi. Uh, it's really good. It's about zombies at its like base, but it has a lot of really cool themes and the animation is absolutely gorgeous. So is there a cowboy in there? There is no cowboys. <laughs> is there a guy named Carl? Nope. Ah, no cowboy, no Carl? <laughs> Next thing is, there's no Shane, is there? <laughs> to kill Shane or not kill Shane? That is the question. So I randomly passed by the event policies. I like this. If you are offended by adult material, turn back now. I actually like that. Copy's not consent. Recording programs and performances is strictly prohibited. Weird. We have bad visible. Report harassment. Okay, that one I can agree with. Not into the hotel dressing up. Yeah. I kind of agree with the, the hotel one, yeah. But if you're 18 years old, yeah, that one definitely for sure. If you aren't allowed to do it outside the convention, it isn't allowed at the convention. Phantom events drive to create an environment which creates the fan community, but with random random. Yeah, you got it. I have in there a t-shirt and the VIP. What else do they have in there? 
Oh, well, they gave me the VIP, the bag itself. The bag, visit Austin. Nice. I, I bought these. <laughs> they also gave you. Oh, look, they're going to cancel. Oh. Nice. Hey, that's a big one. Do you have anyone to give it over to? Uh, I do. Oh, nice. And, oh, a uh, tentacle cool. key cool. keychain. Nice. So that's what you get for being a VIP. And then you also get this. Oh, yeah. What's up, everyone? Uh, Deacon Rap here. Um, I'm media for Etchy Expo this year and oh my god look who it is look who it is look who it is it's Captain Mexico what's up I got the shield yo bro oh my god this is awesome want a beer no no look what yo that's cool that's cool that's amazing bro like, no lie, you should totally enter the cosplay contest. You want to switch hands? Yeah. Okay, right. and whenever you guys are ready. Go ahead. You start it. <laughs> Don't go too hard. Go ahead. You're moving. <laughs> Look at <laughs> Come on, just give up. Throw in the towel. <laughs> Throw in the towel. <laughs> I can do this all You're day. Losing. <laughs> okay, Captain America. <laughs> give up. Go put your arm down. <laughs> no, are you not ready? Oh, okay, that one hurt. <laughs> Don't hit the camera. Move her. <laughs> Shit. Shit. <laughs> Ah, I missed it. It wasn't a good one. Come on. <laughs> you know what This is like a caveman sport. This probably been in my caveman. It's getting so red. Just give up. Just give up. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's no fair. You're, she's in the way. Wake up. It hurts. It hurts. <laughs> Alright, we can stop. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> wow, yeah, that, that's bad. <laughs> Are you filming for SGX? Yeah. Okay guys, so it's officially been like five, six days since SG Expo, and honestly, uh my final thoughts are this is their first year, so I'm not really gonna rip on them too much. But I expected it to be a little bigger. Like, I don't know about y'all, but you know, I expect it to be more than just, you know, what it was. Like, even the uh, diagram that they uh, posted on their website, I expected it to be bigger, but, you know, it's their first year. And I like where they're going with this. They got an interesting concept. I like where they're going with this, and I like to see them grow. Like, I'd like to see SG Expo three, four years from now to see how big they've gotten. But it's their first con, and I can't wait to see what comes next.